Hey folks, Sheila here from Design Files. In today's video, I wanted to show you how you can create detailed financial reports that you can use for yourself or that you can share with your accountant. So if you did want to just kind of quickly get a snapshot of how much you paid in taxes over the last quarter, or if you wanted to get a clear understanding of how much you made from your markup revenue over the last six months, or even if you wanted to put together an entire spread of all your billings so that you can share that with your accountant, you can do that with this new feature. So let's go ahead, we'll jump right in and I'll show you how it works. So what you want to do is you want to go over to your financials page in your design files account and in your financials page you're going to see that there is a button at the top of the page that says create report. You're going to click on that and that's going to take you to this view and in this view you can start making your selections for what it is that you want to include within this report. So you could do a report for all of the invoices that you sent out or you could do a report for any of the design packages that you got sales from. You can also choose to uh, pick the specific time frame that you want to include for this particular report. So there's a number of options you can choose from and of course you can create a custom range. And then you can select the status for those uh, items. So if you wanted to, you could do a report for all of your invoices or you can narrow it down to just the invoices that were submitted, paid, past due, or even partially paid. It's completely up to you. Once you've made your selections here, you're gonna click the button to generate the report. Now in this case, it doesn't look like anything happened, but that's because I've selected all. So if I narrow this down to just paid and I click the button to generate the report, you're gonna see this table update to include just those invoices. I'm gonna go back to all, click the button to generate report, and then down here, this is where I'm going to export it. So I'm gonna click that button, you're gonna see the file show up on your computer here, and then what you can do is you can open up that file. Now when you open up the file, this is the information that you're going to see. So for all of these spreads, you'll see the issue date, the due date for this particular payment, who the client was, what the invoice ID was, which project it was for, the total amount that you billed, what was collected, what the balance is, how much of that was tax, and how much of that was also service revenue and markup revenue, and you'll also see the status for any of those invoices as well. Now at the bottom here of this spread, you can of course uh, tally it up so that you can get the grand totals. So for instance, you can see that I've done that for these uh, columns here. If I want to do it for my markup revenue as well, all I'm going to do is go to the top, click onto the first option here in my markup revenue, go all the way to the bottom of this column and uh, hold down shift and click. And then I'm going to go up here to the functions, hit sum, hit enter on my keyboard, and now I've got the grand total for my markup revenue for all of the uh, invoices that I sent out for this particular time frame. So there you have it. Go ahead, jump into your Design Files account. You can start making some detailed uh, spreads for all of your financials, and this should help you get a better sense of where you stand with your business at any point in time, and it's also gonna help you and your accountant stay more organized. So definitely hop in, give everything a test, and as always, if you have any questions at all, never hesitate to reach out. We're always happy to help.